It's time to play Family Feud. Get up for Steve Harvey. Well, welcome to Family Feud, everybody. I'm your man, Steve Harvey. Woo! Folks, we're turning for our fifth and final day with a total 60574 bucks from Dallas, Texas. It's the champs. It's the Scott family. And they're back from Orlando, Florida. It's the Wilson family. Everybody's here trying to win themselves a lot of cash. And today, if the Scott family wins today's game, they're going to drive out here in a brand new car. Give me Jamel, give me Will. <laughs> Gentlemen, top eight answers on the board. Name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Jamil, hey you, hey you. Pass a play. We're going to play, Steve. They're going to play. Ama, name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Baby, baby. Shonda, name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Sweetheart, sweetheart. Daryl, name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Buddy, buddy. Ori, name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Darling, darling. Jamel, name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Beautiful, beautiful. Ama, name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Honey, honey, honey. Shonda, one answer left, no strikes. Name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Sis, sis. Daryl, only one strike. Name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Bro, bro. Or you got two strikes. The Wilson family can steal. Name something you might call someone on the first date if you forgot their name. Dude, dude, dude. Wilson family, here's your chance to steal. Will, what do you think it is? Name something you might call someone on the first day if you forgot their name. Cutie, cutie. Number five. Dear. Let's move on to question two. Give me Ama, give me Chelsea. Mm -hmm. Ladies, top seven answers on the board. Name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Chelsea, partner, partner. Pass the play. We're gonna play, Steve. They're gonna play.
I'm gonna say this once. Name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Boss. Boss. Jenny, name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Colleagues, more specific. Parents, parents. Becky, name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Kids, kids. Will, name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Siblings, siblings, siblings. Chelsea, name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Therapist, therapist. Tiffany, one answer left, no strikes. Name someone who only pretends to listen to you. Friends, friends. Wilson family got 89. Scott family got 70. Don't go away, so we're coming right back right after this. Welcome back to the feud, everybody. Wilson family got 89. Scott family got 70. Give me Shonda, give me Tiffany. <laughs> Ladies, point values are double. Top seven answers on the board. What bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Shonda, pick nose, pick nose. Pass the play. We're going to play, Steve. They're going to play. Daryl, what bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Burp, burp. Ori, what bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Scream, scream! Jamel, only one strike. What bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Laugh, laugh! Mm. Ama, you got two strikes, you gotta be careful. The Wilson family can steal. What bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Drink, drink. Shonda, what bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Drugs, drugs. What bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Smoke, smoke. Mm. Ori, what bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Bite nails, bite nails. Mm. Jamel, one answer left. Two strikes. The Wilson family can steal. What bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? P. P. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. 
Well, what bad habit will you bet a movie star does when no one is looking? Twerk. Twerk. Number six. Break wind. Scott family got 252. Wilson family got 89. And remember, if the Scott family wins today's game, they're going to drive out here in a brand new car. We'll be right back. Closed captioning and sponsoring part by... Give me Daryl, give me Jenny. Mm -hmm. Point five is a triple. Top four answers on the board. Tell me something a person might ask their partner to quit. Daryl, smoking, smoking. Pass the play. We're going to play, Steve. They're going to play. Ori, tell me something a person might ask their partner to quit. Laughing, laughing. Jamel, only one strike. Tell me something a person might ask their partner to quit. Talking, talking. Ama, tell me something a person might ask their partner to quit. Crying, crying. Mm. Shonda, you got two strikes. If it's not there, the Wilson family can steal and play sudden death. Tell me something a person might ask their partner to quit. Running away. Running away. Mm -hmm. All right, Wilson family, here's the situation. I got two answers on the board. Ah, the answer is there. Your family steals, your family gets to play sudden death. But if it's not there, the Scott family wins the game and drive out of here in a brand new car. Tell me something a person might ask their partner to quit. Job. This is for sudden death. Job. Number two, drinking. Well, nobody reached 300 points. Time to play Son of Death. Give me Ori, give me Becky. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With this survey, we're asking for the top answer only. Whoever gets this one answer will win the game. Good luck to both of you. Here we go. Name a sport where people wear helmets. Ori. Football. Football. We'll be right back. We're gonna play fast money from twenty thousand dollars in the trunk of that car right after this. Welcome back to the field, everybody. The Scott family won the brand new car. And now it's time to play Fast Money! Woo! Alright, you ready? Ready. 20 seconds on the clock. Ding! Time's after I start, after I read this first question. Name the age that a kid no longer wants to be called a kid. 12. 
Name an animal that starts with the letter F. Frog. Name a beverage people drink a lot of in the summer. Beer. Name something you need to give yourself a manicure. Nail file. Name the busiest day of the week at the gym. Saturday. <laughs> Name the age that a kid no longer wants to be called a kid, you said. Twelve. Survey said. Name an animal that starts with the letter F, you said. Frog, survey said. Ding. Mm. Name a beverage people drink a lot of in the summer, you said. Beer, survey said. Name something you need to give yourself a manicure, you said. Nail file, survey said. Ding. Name the busiest day of the week at a gym, you said. Saturday, survey said. All right, Jamil. Yes, sir. Ori got 148 points. Yes, you need 52 right now. I'm gonna ask you the same five questions. Don't duplicate the answer. You do, you're gonna hear this sound. Uh -uh. I'll say try again. Hear no answer. A little tougher this time. We give you 25 seconds. You ready? Yes, sir. Minus everybody of Ori's answers. 25 seconds on the clock. Ding. Time's at the right start. After I read this first question. Name the age that a kid no longer wants to be called a kid. Pass. Name an animal that starts with the letter F. Fear it. Name a beverage people drink a lot of in the summer. Coca-Cola. Name something you need to give yourself a manicure. Nail polish. Name the busiest day of the week at a gym. Friday. Name the age that a kid no longer wants to be called a kid. Sixteen. Ding, 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 ding. Mm. Name the age that a kid no longer wants to be called a kid, you said. 16, survey said. Ding. Mm. Thirteen was the number one answer. Name an animal that starts with the letter F, you said. Ferret, survey said. Fox was the number one answer. Name a beverage people drink a lot of in the summer, you said. Coca Cola survey said. Ding. Beer was the number one answer. We are 22 points from $20,000. Name something you need to give yourself a manicure, you said. Nail polish, survey said. Ding. Nail file was the number one answer. We are six points away from $20,000. Name the busiest day of a week at a gym, you said. Friday. Survey said. Ding. Mm -hmm. 
Saturday was the number one answer. Five dollars a point. That's two hundred seventy-six bucks. That's your five-day total. Eighty-one thousand two hundred seventy-six bucks. The Scott family is taking home in a brand new car. We're going to have two brand new teams to play Family Feud. I'm Steve Harvey. We'll see you next time, folks. Ding! <laughs>